folks, it's Ted here from Clean Waterman. Uh, I had a question from a customer as to why it takes so long for them to get hot water. It's not actually a very long run, it's, you know, it's maybe 25 to 40 feet, somewhere in that range to get to the kitchen. Well, here, here's the issue. The house is plumbed in one inch plumbing. All the outlets for the water, all the faucets, the showers, everything is a low, low flow. It's a low, uh, flow restricted uh, system, uh, which is supposed to save water. Um, now, when you turn on a faucet, you know, say 30 feet away from, from this point, and it's plumbed in one inch, and it's one of those highly restrictive faucets, all the water in this one inch pipe has to be replaced because this water's been sitting here overnight and now it's cool. And um, you have to replace all the water inside this one inch and that will take up to 10 minutes for it. It's a highly restricted faucet, which it, it happens to be in this house. And um, therefore, uh, it takes a very long time to replace the cold water that's inside that pipe with hot water. And the customer would have been much better served in this particular home if they'd actually plumbed the hot water in half inch, maybe three quarter, but half inch would have been much better because it would have taken about one sixth the amount of time to get hot water to the um, to the uh, the places where you need it. All right, so that's what's going on here. Uh, bigger is not always better, and in this case, it's definitely worse. You you definitely um, messed up by putting one inch for the outlet line for the hot water, and uh, unfortunately, the house has a finished basement and um, it's going to be very difficult to replumb this at this point. Thank you for watching.